Radio Gota, hello! Well guys, we're here with a new episode of the Sex Lives of College Girls. I'm very excited to see what's going to happen in this one, so just don't want to talk too much and get done with it. So, uh, let's do it, let's go. Dude, are you studying at a tailgate? Yeah, but only because I'm failing econ. <laughs> well, maybe you'd be doing better if you didn't spend so much time railing Leighton's brother. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bella, Bella, oh Bella, you just spilled beer all over my desk. Oh my god, oh. I'm so sorry. Oh. And Nico's bed doesn't squeak like that. It thuds like bing, bing, Hello, bing, ladies. Bing. Oh my god. Hi, Leighton. Hi, Leighton. Don't Wait, talk about Stop talking when I showed up. Is it, is it my glasses? I know they're ugly, but my fucking mom forgot to She looks so no. cute with those glasses. It's just surprising that you came. Well, I, I'm not really jazzed to watch soccer, but I did want to come and support Whitney. You like Whitney? I'm loving Yes, I like Whitney. She's the glasses. Whitney. Do you like Oh me? my gosh, she looks too adorable. I guess. Stop asking me if I like people. Everyone's fine. Uh, anyway, I can't stay <laughs> long. I have to plan a surprise party for my brother's birthday. Oh my god, I didn't know Nico's birthday was coming up. That's so cool. <laughs> yeah, I always plan his party. And nice. I have some really good surprises in store this time. It'd be really great for me if I could get the Catalan writers in for an exclusive event. Yeah, I'm sure my brother would love to have eight nerdy writers hanging around. No plus ones. But we no are plus ones. invited. Please. Sure. Yes! Come on, you don't have to think about it. You don't have to think about it. Yes, Whitney! No one tells anyone anything. I just want to say this. I actually had heard a lot of time, like a very long time ago, that you were supposed to be after sex. Like, but then no one ever repeated it. Like, I don't know why I heard that. I think someone randomly mentioned it once. And then another friend told me about it because she had had in a UTI or whatever you call it. And I had no idea about that. Like, no one tells you those things. Who tells you those things? Honestly, I think the sex education that we should have in, co in college, mainly in high school, I think it should be every year. I don't know if every country has this. I don't think so. But it should be every year. And they should tell you everything about sex. The world should be a better, would be a better place about a lot of things if people really had a good sex education. Seriously. Like, for real. Like, this is something I'm really annoyed about, is that we never had a good sex education in high school, like, year after year, saying everything there is to say about sex, because it's not just penis, vagina, that's it. That's all you need to know. There's not everything you need to know. There's a lot of things that come with that, and a lot of things that should be talked about in high school, and people should be aware of about different types of bodies, about different types of sex, about different things you can do, you know, about feelings you might have. You know, everything should be covered. I don't know if in your countries they do it, but definitely not here. And it should be talked about. Because then it happens like that, that you're in college and you have no idea that you are like, you should pee. I think it's like a recommendation. I don't know if it's like a must thing you need to do because it doesn't happen to everyone that they get UTIs, but it could happen to you. It's very common. So she should have known that, but no one taught her that. So come on guys, sex education, please, please. There are a lot of other ways to get a UTI. You probably sat on a wet library chair for too long. Right, that's probably it. Anyway, these cold bleachers are really helping <laughs> out the area. She doesn't want to say that she's having sex. And I. I was visiting this week, so if we could talk less about infected genitals. Oh no my god, she's telling her. Something's happening! Oh, oh my god, yes. Yes, Queen. Yes. Come on. Okay, nice. Hey, please get it. No there. pressure. But if you make this shot, we go to the NCAA tournament. No pressure. Oh, damn, <laughs> you got this. Like this. Yeah. 
Oh my gosh. Please, please don't miss it. She's not going to miss it, right? Come on. You got this way, baby! And then beep! Yes! Yes! Angle! Damn! Essex wins! Essex wins? When did he finish there? Oh my god, dude! Like, there were two seconds left of the game and they scored and it's over. Okay. It is 11 a.m. That is 100 community service hours. I am out of here. Please be excited. Oh my god. Ninja Mini Cupcakes! They're allergen free! But full of love and carrot chips. That's so cute. Do you want to stay for the rest of today's meeting? Oh, not at all, actually, but thank you. Alicia, oh. <laughs> not tomorrow, at all. I will cherish all of the lessons you have taught me. And for the rest of you, I think one of you is named Rebecca. Oh, both of you. Don't forget your Both cupcakes. of you. <laughs> you know what, Ginger? I will take one. Oh, God. I'm free, bitches! Woo! <laughs> I'm free, bitches. Oh, my God. I'm glad she doesn't take that as, like... That's a bad thing. But at least it's like, cool, oh, that she's gonna be okay. But one she doesn't want to be there. South you know? Asian woman, one giant leap. New rider alert. Carla, what are you doing here? Did you get top two? Yeah. I worked really yeah. flipping hard on my submission. I guess they really flipping liked it. Oh my god, okay. Well, cool. So fun that you're here. Why is she, Wait, she like that? It's a tradition for new writers to submit a piece on their first day. Pieces are due at midnight. Maybe it'd be cool if we wrote something together. Oh, I'm sure that's not allowed. Evangeline, Bella and I want to co-write a piece. Is that cool? We don't have to, really. It's sure. Uh, Bella and Carla will be writing one together. You can work in groups. Oh my god. Great. Very nice. My wife. Have you seen Borat? Where? Obviously. I'm sure it's... Like, she didn't even ask her if she wanted to co-write with her. Dude, come on. Boundaries. Your first UTI. I remember mine well. I had just conned my way into a birthright trip into Israel. Thanks, Leela, but I'm trying okay. to ignore it. A UTI is a rite of passage. You gotta wear it like a crown. Right? An uncomfortable scratch. What? Can't wait to take off. <laughs> hey, Damn. Girl, I seriously have no idea what to do for that. your birthday, and I'm stressing. Well, I think it's pretty obvious. You gotta get him a sexy gift. Oh, like silky boxer. No, or something erotic, like a cock ring. Oh, what? She's wrong. A <laughs> cock ring? Something nice, but slightly impersonal, so oh you need to too hard. Maybe a nice journal. A journal? Hot guys don't journal. They just let their thoughts fade away. It's what makes them hot. I just want to get into the small and really? meaningful, but something I know he'll like. As long as you pair it with a nasty handwritten card. Something cards, about the like, Golden Girls. I don't know. Go. I love that thick dick. Regards, Kimberly. Oh Ooh, my gosh. You're welcome. Shakespeare. I love her yeah. advice, but no. Hanging out with Darius for a bit, and then you and you and leave the party early. Okay. Sound good? I might be available for that. Cool. So you guys gonna work or something? I am. I'm sick. I have a UTI. Well, uh, good Who luck with that. <laughs> Thank you. Poor baby girl. Drink up. I hey, know her. You wanted to see me? Yeah. Come on in. Let me guess. After the other night, companies are reaching out about endorsing me. I'll hold out for Adidas. It has come to my attention that Coach Dalton has been having an inappropriate sexual relationship with a player. What? That's crazy and gross. Well, I, I have to ask. I mean, do you know anything about this? Or... Me? No. I can't even imagine it. Dalton's so old, he's still on Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> well, do you hear anything? Hello. Let me. Um, obviously, Who you know, uses Facebook anymore? Of course. I'll think on it and let you know if anything comes to mind. Um, I assume you already talked to Becky. Not implying anything, but uh, I did see them share a power bar once. You are not the first person I mentioned that. Oh my god, oh, a power oh, bar? Oh, and who's helpful. Becky? That's throwing someone else under the bus, and that's not nice. Hi, you reached Dalton. Please leave a message and I'll call you back. How did they find Shut out? You know you're like the only person at the casino who's nice to me. I'm sure that'll change with time. Eric's not that bad. Eric. The only time I've seen Eric smile was when I tripped on a cord. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's better than Ryan. Hey, I have an idea for this. Yeah. Piece. What about she doesn't want to talk about that. For the John Essex statue. Sadly. Ryan showing his dick in a bad way. Oh my God. So, he's in. He called me into his office to talk about piece formatting, and then he took it out. And it's all I can think about whenever I'm at the. Oh concert. my God. Same. Can you tell me. I don't know. Everybody already thinks I'm so weird. 
Come together, guys. Do you have anything like that to you? Yes. Right? Dude. Dude. Yeah. Come on. He's a harasser. That's what harassment, dude. You can spell him for yeah. that. Dude, I mean, I get it not saying anything because you're afraid of whatever. Birthday, I will need a but damn, to you should need safely. to be able to talk to someone about it. Well, then I will await your manager's call. At the what store. the hell? She just looked at the girl. Wait. Oh. Oh my god. She. Oh, she just looked at her. Oh, because she's. Well, then I will await okay. your manager's call. Because she's at her girlfriend's oh. place. And she's so afraid someone's a rich mommy party planner. I'm very into that. Oh damn. Um. Hey, what is with your neighbor, the red hair? She was staring at me while I was waiting at the door. Oh, she's my best friend. I'm kidding. I don't talk to my neighbors. Do you think I'm insane? <laughs> Love Dude, playing a party in Vermont is challenging. No one has taste. <laughs> yeah, about that. Am I like invited to this or? Oh, well, I figured you wouldn't want to go. And don't you think you coming oh. as my plus one would be like this whole thing? <laughs> there it is. Yeah. What? You don't want me there because you're worried people will figure you out. Hey, it is a birthday party for my brother who you have met like once. And they got along really well. Let's not make this into a bigger thing than it has to be. It's not about the party. I just, I just want to know that you and me can exist outside of this one room. We can. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, this got weird. I'm, I'm gonna go. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna text you later. She's all ready to be out. Sure. Yeah, she's not ready, and we get it, but I know it sucks. Cause they're all gonna be so cool with it, obviously, like her friends. 